So I decided to make a new comp, a uh, new strategy. It's nothing. It's no big news. It's like something that I have tried before, but with minor changes. Um, this is the comp right here. Until you get Briar, you're just gonna use Elise. As you can see, uh, pretty good distribution of the traits down below. Um, we are going to use the Jace as an item holder for Briar. So we're gonna do attack fighter items for Jace. Jace is a really good one cost uh, attack fighter. Uh, probably, in my opinion, the best attack fighter uh, at one cost. He can solo carry for a long time uh, with the proper items and as long as you just two-star him. So uh, he's a pretty good option. Uh, I played so many comps where I used Jace as an item holder for Briar and this is also one of them. And I also wanted to use Varus a little bit more. Uh, just to see what can he do? What is he all about? Is he good? Uh, although in this This game right here. I did not use bars as a carry um, Just for the blaster pyro uh, Trade What I'm looking for here is bloodthirster um yeah, Bloodthirster, Titanic Resolve, and Hand of Justice. That's what I'm looking for here. And we are, actually have three components that can be used to craft those. So that's not too bad. look like magic what am I I'm not quite sure what I'm doing right here <laughs> okay so we do have a champion duplicator as well I'm uh, probably gonna use that on Briar Yeah, no biggie, Wade Wilson. Wade Wilson, isn't that the guy from Shazam? Isn't he called Wade Wilson? Am I completely wrong here? No, he's called Billy Batson. I'm sorry, I don't know. I don't know why I got that idea. But then who is Wade Wilson? He's from some type, some kind of movie. What is it? What is it? I don't remember. Guys, I'm gonna go ahead and watch Smile 2 uh, in less than a week with uh, two of my sisters and my girlfriend and I'm so excited. So excited. We're gonna have sushi first thing and then we're gonna go out to the cinema and watch Smile 2. If any of you guys watched it, don't spoil anything. Come on, Ash. No, he can't do it. He can't do it. He, I mean she. Oh, she did it. She actually did it. Ash, you did it. You're so good, Ash. There's actually a Gwen there, but the thing about me is that once I have a plan, 
better. Once I have a plan, I go through with it. So even if I had seen a five cost there, which is not possible, and I don't need it in the comp, I would have probably not purchased it. <laughs> uh, that... No, that's a bit exaggerated. Of course I would have done it. I would have. I would have definitely purchased it. Unleash the beast? Yeah. It did, it did not take me long to actually just go, go with that. Oh, I did have the glove too. Okay, those items are strong. Soraka is in the comp too? I didn't remember. What else do I have that is ability power? <laughs> Not gonna lie, Soraka is one of my favorite one cost champions in set 12. I think she's an underrated champion. She is so good. I don't remember why I did that. Like, signaled that enemies were missing. Who wants a piece of this? Who wants a piece of this? Okay, so we also have the Galio. Gonna also get the Rumble in there. Yeah, and Soraka is probably next. Still missing the third mage. What is the third mage? Third mage? Is that... Nami? I think it could actually be Nami. This, this strategy here is not too bad, I think, because if you get ability power items, you can just go uh, use it with uh, Soraka. Honestly, going... Mm, I don't know, what am I choosing here? Who else is going to be my carries? This is going to be Soraka. So I'm planning to do Spear Shoujin. I don't think that's bad. I don't think that's bad at all. It's... Uh, it's a little bit annoying that I still only have a one star... Uh, one star Jace. Jace is just still one star, man. How is that? Yeah, it is the Nami. The Nami is actually in the comp. So, 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 so. So, Raka, I forgot to tell you about this, guys first thing because if you get ability power items you can still play this comp you're just gonna give them to Soraka and I mean if you want you can try and three star Soraka but if you don't succeed you can just transfer those items to Nami uh, and it's all good it's all good it's no problem Maybe I go with items directly on Nami since I just got the Nami there. Um, Soraka is definitely the next champion to enter the field for the for the Mage Sugarcraft. Now I can go both Spirit Shoujin, I can, I can do Nash's Tooth. I'm the carry now. Yeah, probably gonna go with I'm the carry now, really like that. Grab it, go grab it. I'm sure I'm gonna take it, I did. 
I did. I should uh, use these items. Why don't I go with... Okay, this is a mistake. Okay, okay, okay. I see, I see, I see. Come on, give Spiro Shoujin. Okay, I'm gonna go Soraka and not the Nami. That's interesting. That's interesting. I mean, I do like Soraka a lot. But I do still think that Soraka is better. This, I uh, mean, sorry, Nami is better. Unless Soraka can get Archangel's staff. Yeah, I think having the item some Nami here would could have probably made a difference. So I think it's a mistake going with the items on Soraka here. I should definitely take the items off and go with Nami. Yeah, that Cassidy doesn't matter. I should just sell the Cassidy right away. What are the last champions that I'm looking for here? Uh, we have Multi Striker and we have Blaster. I don't remember. That was an easy win, though. I lend my aim. Oh, it's Akali. Oh, obviously, obviously Akali for the multi-striker um, Pyro. Uh, and then we have the Pyro Blaster, uh, which is Varus. Those are the last two champions. And then just replacing the Elise with Briar. That's the last thing to be done with this comp. I still only have a one star, one cost Jace with three completed items. That has been my carry all up until this point and I'm, st I'm still winning. Uh, she just add the... How important is multi striker right now? Multi striker is not that important. Um, so what am I doing here? I should have added the pyro blaster instead, the uh, virus. I should go blue buff. I should go, I should go blue buff on the Soraka and then transfer those items to the Nami. Yeah, I can't lose anymore. Okay, we did get the Briar. We have two Briars, and now we also we also have a Champion Duplicator. So we're, we're set. We're set. Uh, we have all the items in the world that we need right there. Next to Gunblade. Yeah, give respect that. Oh, I have to hurry though. Okay. At this point, I'm like, okay, no big deal. Okay, so I'm still keeping the items for uh, Soraka. But yeah, my Briar is really strong at this point. And uh, the last thing I need here is the Varus. Actually, 
if I were to play this right now, I would have given this the items that I have on Soraka. I would have given them to Boris. I would have. Okay, listen, listen, guys. I would have given the Spear of Shojin, along with the Giant Slayer. Um. I would have given those to Varus, and then the Nash's Tooth I would have given to Nana. That's what I should be doing here at this point. But it's not. I don't think that's what I'm gonna do. Yeah, I guess... I, to me, this is not the right play. It's not the right play. Soraka is not good enough here. Varus is the one that should have gotten items. Because then... When you think about it, the strategic aspect of it, then you have Nami as your AP backliner. You have Briar as your uh, attack fighter frontline. And then you can have Varus as your attack caster backline. Those are the three champions that I would... Uh, that should be your carry. Uh, when playing this. Oh god. When playing this combo. That's what it should have been. And we, we don't have a real tank. So you rely heavily on the Briar to... To do some good stuff actually. <laughs> uh, don't know what I'm doing here. That for Rumble or Galio. I don't know. Take the charm, back row star. Yeah, that's that's pretty much the only thing we can do here. The only strong front lining we have is a Briar. If you don't count the carry. Golem. So we are in the top three. And we actually have another two star Briar. So at this point, I'm probably looking for a three star. <laughs> Could be fun getting a three star Briar. So what you see here, I mean, the comp is complete. And even though Soraka, I have all the love in the world for Soraka, but in this particular comp, this particular comp, she should not be one of my carriers. I think that Varus should be. Giant Slayer for Varus. That should be the play here. Giant Slayer for Varus. And honestly, uh, yeah, last whisper. And then I would have taken the Spear of Shojin off of the uh, Soraka with a magnetic rem remover. Honestly, only two briars away from having a three star briar. <laughs> Man, but it's it's a mistake not to replace that. Um, Soraka right there and give the Spear Shojin to Varus. The guy I'm gonna face here has eight portals. Eight freaking portals. And it's. I, th this is just not the strongest cut right here. Um, it's okay. 
Uh, there is a briar. What I should be doing, I should sell off the rest, Soraka, virus, sell them off, and then try to get it through Sobriar. But I guess I was thinking, um, I thought I was going to uh, win this round, but I didn't. I didn't. So, I got a second place, and I came close to a first place, but second place was all I got. Second place is, is still a win. It's still a win. The comp can't probably work for you. I think it can.